capping off FAMU's 2023 football season success with a celebration while new questions remain to be answered for the upcoming season. We're going to be ready. I'm Terry Gilliam, your neighborhood reporter in Southwest Tallahassee. I take a look at how the news is affecting the football program. Everything's just a blur. That was FAMU running back Kelvin Dean Jr. He was part of the Rattlers championship run for the 2023 season. I just want everything to be settled so that I can be the leader that my teammates need me to be. He's referring to recent news after coming off an historic season. The Rattlers went undefeated in the SWAC and defeated Howard in the Celebration Bowl, bringing home their second national title since 1978. Now, former FAMU head football coach Willie Simmons will be taking a job at Duke University. On top of that change, Rattlers Director of Recruiting, Devin Rispress, will be joining the University of Colorado staff in 2024. Just thinking about all the success we had, you know, people are going to want to come and take away from what's good. You know, they want winners, so I, I mean, I can't say I don't respect the decision. Friday was the FAMU Championship Bowl celebration at the Al Lawson Center. It's also where I asked FAMU President Dr. Larry Robinson if the new uncertainties overshadow the celebration of accomplishments. He tells me. In the business of sports and really, you know, employment in general, uh, people move around quite a bit. So you can't take it for granted that anyone who was as successful as Coach Simmons was here that they're going to be here forever, right? And so we now have to take advantage of all of that momentum as a community, right? And come up with something positive. I also asked FAMU Athletic Director Tiffany Don Sykes what taking advantage of the momentum looks like for the program. We are having a special board meeting on Tuesday and looking forward to naming a new head football coach, the 19th full-time head coach in FAMU football history, very shortly thereafter. With things moving swiftly in the race to filling new positions in the program, Dean Jr. says there's no pressure and it won't rain on the parade. That'll motivate us to come and work harder. You know, it's going to be a bigger target on us. So all we got to do is just, we got to keep standing on business. FAMU officials tell me they plan to find solutions quickly for the program heading into the spring. In Southwest Tallahassee, Terry Gilliam, ABC 27.